Hi guys, it's Andrew. Welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title, Chop Club came. And I figured, as always, I would unbox this for you guys. A little bit about this box. Um, first and foremost, many of you may know if you follow me on social media. If you do not, Josh and I are expecting a little one come mid-August. So this box is pretty much all directed towards maternity. So if you guys don't want to watch maternity and hear me talk about my pregnancy, then don't watch. But if you guys want to see what's in this box, just keep watching. Holy moly. All right, here we go. I talked to Haley and I said, Haley, listen, Josh and I are expecting if you could go ahead and send me some pregnancy slash maternity clothing. That would be amazing. So that's exactly what she did. Oh, it looks like we have two pairs of shoes in here as well. So let's do this. All right, here is what the first bundle looks like as always. Oh, let's do shoes first because I'm a shoe. I'd rather spend money on shoes than clothes. Everyone knows that. So hold on. Okay, here is the first pair of shoes. They are size seven and a half by seven and a half by Vince Camuto. Ooh, how cute are these? Awesome. I hope they're stretchy. I heard that when you're pregnant, your shoe size can go up. So that's that's terrifying because I mean I have a huge closet like the Velcro. I have a huge closet full of sevens and a halves, and if my feet got fatter or bigger or whatever, I'd have a conniption. So, um, I already own a pair just like this, believe it or not. Not necessarily with the open heel, but the booty with a clunky heel, which I really can appreciate, but I automatically know that I have a pair like this, so I might just have to pass. But yeah, how awesome or how awful if all of a sudden all your, your shoe size just got so much bigger and you couldn't wear any of your shoes anymore. Please, please don't let that happen to me. Thank you. So, and here are these. These are my cores. What are these? Oh, these are stinking cute. These look like these are loafers. Not necessarily my style by any means, but these are definitely cute for the person that is looking for a nice loafer slide on shoe. Black, white, these little, this little detail here is silver. I'm going to try these on. Not my style, but I can appreciate a good, cute shoe. Okay, and let's go back to this bundle. Here is this bundle. It looks like there's a lot. There's one color that I'm kind of iffy about, but let's open this and see what we have. So the first thing is a black tank. Ooh, is it high-low? It does look like it's a high-low. This is very sheer, but it could be layered. This is by the company Treasure Bond, and it is $35, and I appreciate the fact that this is a high low. As always, guys, I will be trying all of this on, as always, so if you guys are interested in what everything looks like on my little body, you're more than welcome to fast forward and check everything else out. But here is this. This I can already tell you I'm probably keeping. 35 bucks, a nice tank, done. And what is the next thing we have? Ooh, are these yoga pants? Looks like they are yoga pants, reversible by Zella, Z-E-L-L-A. Can't go wrong with these. In fact, what size are these? These are size small, $48. I wonder what the other side looks like. Would it be the same? It looks the same. So I guess if you're having one of those mornings where you don't know if you don't want to put your clothes inside out or right side in or whatever it may be, you can just buy a pair of these. That's pretty cool. I'll try these on. I was told that yoga pants and black leggings are your best friend during pregnancy, so I might just be stocking up on all of them. Here is a black, another black t-shirt. It is by the company Vince. It's $68 in the size small. Not sure if I like how short this is because I'm very conservative and I do hair for a living. And because in my hair salon, I, I lift my arms all day for doing blowouts curls, updos, you name it, color. I don't want my belly to show. You know what I mean? Like, you ever seen those men, and sorry for even judging about this, but you ever seen those men that every single time they lift their shirts, their belly show, and it's the most sweetest thing you will see all day long? Yeah, I don't want to be that person, so I don't know if that's a go already. Moving forward, this looks like, ooh, this looks like a maternity dress. This is by the company Seaport, I do believe. It's Ellie Dressed Small. Oh, this is a NOM collection, N-O-M collection. I will try this on. I am very terrified of trying on anything maternity. 
I don't know. They also told you you're supposed to glow, so... Uh. Me glowing is me trying not to vomit on the back of my client's head because I got evening sickness during this pregnancy. Well, this is my first pregnancy, so... I get evening sickness while I'm pregnant this time. First time. Anyways, moving forward. Terrified of trying on anything pregnancy. And that color... I don't know. The next item looks like... Ooh... Here we go, here we go, up my alley. This is by the company Clayson. It's a petite small. I don't know how much it is. I will put it down below. But it looks like it is your traditional maxi dress. It has a little bit of weight to it, which I like. I like a thicker fabric. Reason being is it kind of drapes a little bit better on myself versus like the light ones I can kind of flow away and yes. Anywho, excited to try this on. Very excited because this might be my new go-to pregnancy dress. And here is this. This is a Ingrid and Isabel belly band in white, size 1. It says, go ahead, flaunt your bump and let the belly band hold up your pants. Or hold your pants up. This is good to know. Hmm. One of my dear clients told me that this is also a belly band. I think they have them at Target as well. Kind of wish this was in black, but I'm not for, I think for video purposes, white is great so you guys can see how it fits around my belly. Anyone asks, I am four months along, about 17 weeks pregnant. Yes, mm -hmm, it's been a long 17 weeks. Moving along. Here is the next item. Ooh, what is this? Oh my goodness, what is this? This is a jumper, but it's not a full jumper. It is like a, uh, goes to like, well, I'm shorter, so it'll probably hit my ankles, but I'm guessing this is supposed to be like a midi type of jumper. Let's see here. This is by the company First State. This is in rich black and it is $129. Gosh, this is so cute. Oh my gosh, so cute. Excited, excited for this. Super excited. And the last but not least, the last thing that is here that I received is a... Is this a dress? Oh, uh, I think this is a dress. Maybe? It's by the company Hinge, and it's a size small. I don't know how much it is, but it's in the color Olive Tree. You know, when I approved this trunk, I really thought that this was a jacket type vest, but now looking at it, it is a dress. I'm excited for this. I wonder if you can adjust. I don't know if you can adjust the waist. Pros and cons, I guess, but I'm excited for that. So, as always, I will be trying everything on, so hold on a moment and I'll get right to that. Alright, for all of you that this is your first time watching my video, I am usually around a size 2, 4, depending, maybe even a 6, depending on the company. I am very narrow hips. Um, I was very narrow hips. And this is little baby O. Right there. Yeah. So that's, that's what I'm trying to adjust my wardrobe around as of right now. But yes, let's go ahead and try on these clothes. Hold on. Okay, here is that first tank top I talked about. I will be going in order from the first thing I received to the last. Uh, here is this. I'm sure you guys can't tell. Oh, there you guys. Um, very perfect, very basic. I really can't go wrong with this. I am scared because of the material. I'm not sure if you guys can even tell that it may shrink a little bit because it's more of like that ribbed cotton material, but I'm still gonna get it. Love it, might just have not be able to put it in the dryer. And then I am put on those reversible leggings. These are snug as a bug in a rug on me, guys. So um, I have a long way to go yet, so I think that I will have to pass I think after post delivery that I would probably buy something like this, especially because they are compression style, they feel like, and I would feel better about buying them afterwards, that way I could fit into them and be like a goal versus when I first, yeah, um, yeah, pass, mm -hmm. Okay, here is that second black top I was talking to you guys, um, it's very boxy, I just know my body type, and I, well, I'm getting to learn my new one, and I don't think that this would flatter, flatter me as well, so this is just a no, but I figured I'd show you guys. Very, very low cut, kind of awkward in the shoulders, in the sleeves, but moving forward. All right, you guys are the first people to see me try on a maternity outfit, so 
maternity clothing dress, I guess you could say. Anyways, if this was in black, we'd be talking a different story right now. But here is this. Uh, oh God. I don't know how I feel. Um, it rouges all the way down. It go hit because I am shorter. It hits a little bit awkward length, and that's just something I always have to work with. But if this is how stuff's gonna fit, it's supposed to fit. It's not bad, and I think the moment I start getting a little bit bigger and showing a little bit more, dang, I don't, dang, uh. I'm gonna pass. If it was in black, like I said, we'd be talking a different story, but this this color I think is just, yes. Mm -hmm. Moving forward. All right guys, here's that dress I was really like, super excited to try on. Um, pregnancy gave me some new puppies so that, are, that are very voluptuous at the moment, and this dress makes me feel very self-conscious about them. But I think it's just motherhood and I have to embrace it, so I'm gonna show you. But this dress is an absolute no-go. But here we go. Oh boy, maybe, oh boy, um, that's just too, it's just too much for me and I feel so uncomfortable even showing you guys on camera. Maybe I could use that belly band as like a boob band. Could that be a thing and I could just cover these, these bad boys up? It's not a bad dress, I just feel very insecure about this at the moment. So here's the back. I think it does well and it's very shapely and the fact that it hides your belly if you're trying to hide a belly. Um, it doesn't make you look pregnant by any means, which is kind of good if you're, like I said, if you're trying to hide it. I'm kind of embracing it at the moment because I can't get away from it. Um, but this is an absolute no-go for me. This is too much. This is, yes, too much. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, here is the jumper. Now, it does hit me right, almost like number one culottes. Were they even called culottes? Gaucho pants? Remember how they kind of hit you in the mid-shin-ish area and they're loosey-goosey? Well, this is what this looks like on me, but it's a jumper, and I'm absolutely in love. Unfortunately, I don't think I will be able to wear it much longer. Um, this is a size, size small. Um, it fits perfect at the moment, absolutely sinking perfect, but give it a, I don't know, a week or two, and I'm pretty sure this won't fit anymore. And I'm debating if I should even keep it in my closet. Reason being is I don't know what my body's going to look like after pregnancy, and I'm not sure if I do shrink back down to my normal original size, would it be too big? I don't know if wearing a belt could even help it, but, oh, I have, to, I have to button that. But this is stinking adorable. Why couldn't you have sent this to me last year, Haley? Because I would have been rocking the ish out of this. So, excuse me. Anywho, moving forward, love this. Love, 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 love. All right, here is that girl of green dress. You remember how you always talking about in the video if this is adjustable? It is, but inside of here. So there's a, like a little bulky fabric going on that you can adjust this. But if you guys can tell, I am shorter. I am very petite. So anything like this does not work well with my body because I feel as if this should be up here a couple inches and then everything else would look nice. But it just, it looks frumpy on me at the moment, so unfortunately this is a no-go. Um, I wouldn't be opposed to a lighter piece of fabric and a different shape of a uh, dress like this, but I do like the color, so the color's kind of cool. But just not, just not me at the moment, but I will be trying on that belly band. So, hold on. Okay, here is the original tank top that I will be keeping. Like I said, $35, can't go wrong. You guys can get a better idea that it is a high-low. Here are my jeans. These are my twos. They just don't fit together anymore. I'll show you how they used to fit. I mean, technically, yes. Can I do it? Yes. Muffin top. That's not, that's not cute. Um, I have been doing the hair tie thing in which, here. Thanks, Mom, for teaching me this. Loop it through here. And then like that. So that can kind of still get me away with these jeans. In fact, I feel more comfortable. Just that little extra support makes me feel better. And I can probably still rock these for an hour or another month, I'd say at least. Let's let's open this and see what what this is. Let's try a belly band. This is called a Bella Band, kind of like the Bellas, the Singing Bellas. Oh my gosh, I love that movie. What is it? Pitch Perfect? Pitch Perfect? I wonder if I'll have a hard time putting this back together, but let's pray. 
So hold on a second, I'll fast forward and I will show you what this looks like. This is the size, let's look at this again. So this is the size one, and this is made for smaller hips, a smaller waist, or a pregnancy with multiples. And this is pre-pregnancy pants. Oh wow, so this is pretty cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna zoom in and let you guys see this for a second. This is where I am. This is size one. You can use it before, during, and after pregnancy. But that's pretty cool. So it's supposed to hold up your pants, you can't even tell that they're unbuttoned. And here's that. And then it says er, later in pregnancy, like you roll it up, you roll it up all the way full term. And after pregnancy, you can wear it as kind of like a waist trainer to kind of hold and suck everything in, which is kind of effing awesome. Who thought of this? Because you need a high five. This is perfect. I am not sure how much this is. I really wish it was in black. That's how it would look. It would just look like I'd be wearing another t-shirt underneath it. And it's kind of like holding everything together, which is awesome. So... Da, 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 da. Hold on one second and I will conclude this whole video for you guys. Hold on. All right, here we go. Let's see what Haley had to say. Uh-oh. You guys remember that WTF video I did? This is someone else's packing slip with my contents of the box. I'm going to move forward from this. I'll contact Haley because this is just, yep, moving forward. Um, so... Long story short, um, I can't tell you the prices of everything because, like I said, this is, uh, this is someone else's packing slip to go into my box. So that is a bummer. I really want to know what Haley had to say, and I kind of wanted to give you guys the prices. But other than that, Josh and I are extremely, extremely grateful and happy and blessed for this little bundle of joy to enter our lives. Like I said, I have about six more months left. I think actually five more months left. Yes, I have five more months left, so we're, pre prep we're prepping, we're preparing, that's where I've been. I had horrible spouts of evening sickness and hormones, enough said. No one ever mentioned hormones. I mean, they did, right? I mean, like, everyone knows that, like, you can cry and stuff, but, oh my goodness. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I love doing these unboxing videos. Do you guys know of any pregnancy or, like, expecting boxes? I know there's baby bump. But do you guys know of any other up and coming boxes? I'm really excited to, excuse me, maybe try those out. But other than that, I hope you have a great day. I hope you guys learned something as always. And I will catch you in my next video. Bye, guys.